Hi guys, I'm here with Team Shifts Loot Focus. What did you do this weekend? Uh, I made top eight at the Peterborough Region. Nice one, what were you playing? Uh, salads. Mm. Want to show us the list? Yep. So, three Gazelle, three Spinny, three Foxy. Um, seen a couple of like two Foxy, but the majority of these are like the good starter cards, so I don't need to explain any of those. <coughs> one Jaguar, one Falco, still standard. You use them in, um, they're usually your Stalio targets. Um, this card's so good, like setting um, a card every turn off this makes, makes this deck like a lot better than it would be. Yeah, I played two foul. I didn't even know about this card until like three days before the original. Um, someone explained the combo to me where you make Dweller off the normal combo because you summon this from deck and then Falco bounce it and then resummon it. Um, and I like that so much that I decided to play two just because hard drawing it is still really good because you can do all of that and you don't have to summon it off um, the Stalio. So you just make Dwell with it super easy. Um, you can also chain block Gazelle from Ash. So seems good. Um, and then we played some Buffalo de Flams. Um, I completely dropped debug. It's awful in the mirror and I expect there to be a lot of mirror. Um, yeah draw two is really good when you're playing Zank and you just want to dig for it because it's not a win card. Scythe, like I said, auto win card. Um, even if you draw it, it's not terrible. Um, good players usually figure out if you've got it because, like, you can figure out when they would flip the back row that they would flip. Um, but you can always shuffle. You can, sometimes it gets Helio spun. Um, sometimes you can Phantasme it away. And then Hand Traps played three Phantasme because you dig for the good cards in your deck. Thanos um, Dragon! It's also insane in the mirror because, like, there's no card in the deck that's bigger than this. They have to spinny target Helio to attack over it. So like it's such a problem, they have to Stalio chain it one, Falco chain it two, just to put this off the board. And if they, and that only works if they summoned it that turn. So yeah, this card's busted in the mirror. And three Ash, because it's the most versatile hand drop. And I also played two Crow. Um, I didn't want to commit to three of this card, just because it's bad in multiples, and it's not good in every matchup. But like when you're playing Phantasma, you're able to play a bit more variety of hand traps because you can draw into them off Phantasma. Um, it's great in the mirror. It's good against Striker. And they're the main two hand traps that, that come up. Spell card, don't play three circle. Um, one field spell, one fusion of fire, one super poly. Um, you're forced to play this, and you you should play this. Um, but I expected there to be enough Salaman Great to warrant main this because it is another Rotor Wing card in your mirror. And then I play one Desires. Um, I was at 39 cards and I didn't last play it. And I haven't actually tested playing Desires in the deck, but I thought if I play one, at least I won't ever draw multiples. Um, I didn't draw this at all, so I don't know if it was any good. Um, trap wise, we played one Raw, two Rage. Um, I just think this is a better card in most matchups. Um, non targeting pop 2 is insane, and a lot of the time, like if you send Rage and set it, they think you already have Raw and they play around it. I don't know. I just think it's it's like this is the card I want to hard draw. <clears throat> Three Sanctum, busted card. You win so many matchups just because you drew this card. Even going second, you like I've seen people slide this out going second, I don't know what they're doing. Um, Going second, it's like, it's like D Barrett back in zoo format. Um, you just turn off their turn. And usually, like if you both see Sanctum, the person who went second will win because their Sanctum resolved after. So, and then two more hand traps was uh, Imps. Um, they clash with Phantasme so rarely that I didn't think it was worth playing Vela because, um, like, yeah, you can draw Vela or Phantasme and it's still alive, but Vela can't negate Dweller and Vela can't negate Scythe. And you need to be able to negate those okay. two cards in the mirror. Glass of water. Yeah. So that's the main it's 40 cards. Um, I didn't play Will, I can't awful. Jack, you're wrong. Um, <laughs> and like some of the texts were sort of mained because I expected to play lots of Sally. Um, at a bigger regional, I'd probably change some of the cards, but I really like the list for the day. Uh, so extra deck I played. Three Bay Links. I've seen a couple of this drop list for two. Um, and it's, I don't know, I don't think I would. Three Wolf, obviously, and two Helio. Um, it's a shame you have to play two of those for the OTK because, you know, you know it's not the greatest card. Uh, the one Fusion, the one Stalio, all of that's completely standard now. 
uh, as is all of this as well. Um, I think this is the only card you can maybe cut. This card's insane, especially when you summon it and are able to use its effect properly. <laughs> Shout out to Chalk. Yeah. Uh, and this card gets a current link to draw. And then this card still stuff. Like, yeah, this is such a standardized sector deck now where there's almost no room to change it. And the Dweller because it's insane in the mirror. It's crazy. And then side deck, we played, or oh, just showed off the biggest text I'll put, I'll show that first. We played uh, one para para. Um, I imagine people know about this now. Like, if you're close to time and no five minutes left and game two ends, you can side this in and then just summon this off Stalio. Um, if you're close to time, it can, it can win you games just like Kana does for Sky Striker. Did it come up at all? Um, no, I never, never did it. Never, never had to. <coughs> Three draw. Um, it's good for the decks. Yeah, they're nice. Uh, it's good for the decks like Thunder, Guard Dragon, uh, Dragon is Striker as well. Um, but it's awful in the mirror, so I wouldn't paint it. Triple Bankrupt, best side card right now. Um, just clears two cards almost any matchup you play in. It's when you over and it pops something. It clears Floodgates, um, it clears Fire Prison, Jack. Uh, you know, it, clears, it clears cards like Summon Limit, and there can be only one, and you know, cards that don't let you play the game. Dwayne does the same thing. Going second, you need a new deck. Reboot for All Geist and Draco because you've got a fairly consistent OTK, um, so you just need to turn off the traps to do it. And then two more Fusion of Fire. Um, going second in the mirror, um, you just want to hard draw this or Super Poly and force out their raw immediately. Um, Any shout outs? Uh, yes, quite a few. Uh, shout out to our sponsors, Malfox. Shout out to everyone in the team. Uh, we got five people in Top Cut. Uh, Alex won the regional. Uh, and then me, Jack, Harry, Michael got fifth, sixth, and eighth. So shout outs to everyone. Um, shout outs to Carl. He lent me Sunlight Wolves because I don't want to pay £10 for rares. Um, shout outs to Gant, who lent me Imps and tested with me and Alex all week. Um, Forgetting something all the time. <coughs> if I've forgotten, I've forgotten. I will. Yeah. Right. Thank you very much. Cheers.